Hey guys, welcome to CR Inter Designers. This is Chetan and this is the Hard Surface Modeling Hack 8. If you are new on this YouTube channel, then don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and you can follow us on Instagram where we upload regular posts related to the CG art. And now let's get started. Shift A and then add a cylinder. And we will go with the 20 words. So just give the 20 count. And then you need to scale down the cylinder along the Z axis. Go to the edit mode and select this face and then you need to extrude this face along the z-axis and scale it down. Then add a loop cut like this and now you need to select the bottom words and delete them. And then select this face and press I for the insert operation. And you need to use the little bit more insert operations at there. Okay, now you need to select these words and then right click and then connect vertex path. And you need to create the plus shape that's why i have used the 20 words here so just select these words right click and then connect vertex path and create a chord based topology then select these faces you can see the plus shape and then delete them after that you need to select these words and you need to connect them before that we will delete the words because we will use the mirror modifier so you can delete them and we will create the design only on one side so just select these words and then connect them and then you need to add the words like this and then add a loop cut and now here you need to create the chord based topology so just select this edge loop and you need to extrude this edge loop along the z axis And then you need to select these words and then connect them. And then add a loop cuts like this. And then select these words and then right click and then connect them. So select this edge loop and control X to dissolve that. And now you need to create the chord based topology add there. So just select these edges and you can dissolve them. So just select these edges and you can dissolve them and now you can see we got the chords at there and we have created the chord based topology and you can add the loop cuts like this and double tap g for the edge slide you can see the face loop which we have created and then you can add the subduing surface modifier and increase the level up to two and now you can see we need to create a loop structure add there so we can avoid the weird shading. So just add loop cuts like this and select these words and merge them at the center. So we can create that loop structure. And then you can select these edges and dissolve them. Control X to dissolve them. And use the edge slide to give the right position to your words. And then you can turn on your subdivision surface modifier and you can see we have avoid that weird shading. With the help of that loose structure we have created this. And then you can add more loop cuts on the model to maintain its form. And now you can see it's look decent. Then you need to add the mirror modifier and make sure your mirror modifier should be top on your subdivision surface modifier and turn on that clipping option. And take the symmetry from the X and Y axis and shade smooth it. Now you can see it's look decent. You can apply that mirror modifier and now you need to select these edge loops and we need to fill these caps. So just E to extrude it and scale it down. So I will just select the one side and I will delete this because I will create same kind of thing from the one side and then I will take the mirror one more time. 
so just select these edge loop words and then move them along the x axis and try to keep the same distance in between these edges means in, in between these face loops and then add loop cuts like this and then you can add mirror modifier one more time then apply that mirror modifier and make sure that clipping option should be on and then apply that mirror modifier and then select this edge loop and press F to fill the gap and here you need to create the right topology so just select the words and then right click and then connect vertex path and try to create the core based topology Then you need to select these faces and then press I for the insert operation and give the small insert operation and then you need to use the loop tool for the circle. Okay, now you need to select the words and then you need to create connect them. So before that just control X to dissolve this and now you need to connect this like connect the words like this. So just select these words and then right click and then connect vertex path. And now you can see we have created the core based topology at the center. So in this way you can diversify your topology and you can create loop structure around your model so you will get decent look on your model. That face loop structures is important which will help you to get the good shading. And now you can see our model looks decent. So thanks for watching if you like this tutorial then hit that like button and subscribe our youtube channel. Bye bye, so in the next video take care.